Waklo Fatu, Kiarakoto, Gere. As you have seen, we have been pushing forward the awareness of what's going on in Parliament under your very watch. The fact that you have no say in what happens in government and in Parliament. And this is something that we have been speaking and detailing about ever since 2017. In fact, a little bit further, but with this particular government, 2017. Now, we read through the bill five times to make sure we didn't get anything wrong. And the new enforcement officers is yet just part of an expansion of government power, yet again. This government is the most dangerous government that we have ever seen in this country. And I love this country. I have a deep, passionate love and a jealous love of this country and I know that many of you do too and under our very watch is it being lost and taken taken by some of the most insidious nefarious manipulative people that we have ever had and it is all covered over with a veneer of smiles and ad nauseum usage of the word kindness facilitated by a media so partisan that they suppress conservative voices and allow an occasional token voice. The situation is unacceptable. We as New Zealanders demand that our nation be our nation. So together with you, my fellow New Zealanders, my fellow Kiwis, make your voice loud long and do not forget when the budget comes out and bribes you do not forget when the big waffle talk happens do not forget that this government is not only incompetent they are also insidious the media where we seem to be doing a better job than they are of telling what is going on is complicit in the removal of our very values with an ideology that is of deep, deep, deep trauma to nations worldwide. We will fight to the bone, to the bitter end for you, our people, so that you may have a voice, so that this nation, which was fought for and bled for and died for, is not taken away by the very system that we put in place. Make your voices loud. Let them be heard. Because this year, we win back what we have lost or we lose the rest. God bless you. God bless New Zealand.